and a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm correctly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? This is the lineup for the home team. Well, when you play in a 3 5 2 formation, the position of the wing backs is key. If they drop too deep, you can't dominate possession. And if they play too high, you leave the centre backs exposed. They have to get the balance right. And a look at the lineup for Fiorentina. Corentin Toliso starts alongside Lucas Torreira in the middle of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And so the battle commences. Diata. He's in behind. And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. So underway again here, one nil the score. Zhu. Oh, lovely ball. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Beating Delhi. Well, he has the measure of his man. And that was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. Options in the middle. Just unable to get his cross beyond the first defender. Well, just hearing things have changed in the Bologna game. So it seems like a good time to join Alex Scott. It's a goal for Bologna. Surely. And the keeper had the measure of it.
Short corner taken. Toliso. Tremendous block. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. And Fiorentina will get the throw in. Well, that's a completely wasted throw in. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. More live football from Serie A coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Monza facing Sampdoria. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. And deep into the penalty area. But he didn't miss by all that much with the header. Just a little bit off target. Very quick thinking there. Musa. Well, that looked to me like excessive force. What was the referee's reading of it? And it is red. The referee left with no option but to send him off. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Derek. I think it's a poor challenge. He had to go for that. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Has eyes for goal! Well, he had it on target, but it was never going to trouble the keeper. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. David Zima. And the referee blows for a foul. It will be decision time, the second leg of the Champions League quarter-final. And you'll see it live with us here on EA TV. It's Fiorentina versus Paris Saint-Germain. What a good second leg that should be. The first leg had lots of quality, and I'm expecting more of the same. And he whips it in. Well, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Well, as you can see from those stats, their attacking play just hasn't been good enough. They need to start getting the ball into the final third more often and play at a quicker tempo. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And over comes the corner. in strongly to win the ball Camara Carlos Augusto that's not a bad ball just couldn't capitalise there well very effective play in possession the crossbar got in the way well, threat averted. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Camara. So there goes the half-time whistle. It is an acceptable scoreline from the point of view of the visitors. They find themselves on top, Stuart. Well, we were concerned about their defence before the game. But today, they've looked a solid outfit. They've defended as a unit. They've been compact and they've counter-attacked at the right time. This has been a very good display.
And the contest begins. Diata. He's in behind. And a goal it is. No long wait for the opener today. Surely. And the keeper had the measure of it. And deep into the penalty area. Well, he didn't miss by all that much with the header. Just a little bit off target. Musa. And it is red. The referee left with no option but to send him off. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Oh, breezing past him. It's got to be. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Samuele Birindelli. Now with Uribe. Can he take the chance? He scored once already and close to making it a double. Double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. And a substitution in the offing. Short corner it is. Toriso. What a shot from miles out. And he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. A real opening now. And the ruling is offside here. An alert intervention. Really a very poor ball. Hansko. On the ball, Diata. Take it away. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? A fine reading of the situation. Kamara. Pereira. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Hansko. Disappointing pass. Passes like that, very much in his repertoire.
Yunus Musa. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Torreira. Now with Tolisso. In a position from which they could potentially... Well, highly inventive, and it wasn't far away. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Quite simply, he hadn't done that. Well, here it is again, and there's no getting away from it. It's a big blunder. He's just got that all wrong, hasn't he? So the ball rolling again at 2 0. And out of play for a Fiorentina throw in. Bobega. Mateo Suribe. Saul. Well, a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Five minutes to go. Bobega. And in with a real chance. And there it is. That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3 0. Chance to finish. In it goes. Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. And we're underway again. This game very much over as a contest. And so the final whistle here, the visitors come out on top, Stuart.
Well, we talked before the game about their poor defending, but today it was all about their attacking play. They really did show a lot of quality in possession, particularly in the wide areas. That was a good win for them. Diata. He's in behind. And a goal it is. No long wait for the opener today. Surely. And the keeper had the measure of it. And deep into the penalty area. Well, he didn't miss by all that much with the header. Just a little bit off target. Musa. And it is red. The referee left with no option but to send him off. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Can he take the chance? He scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. Well, highly inventive, and it wasn't far away. The goalkeeper is wishing, quite simply, he hadn't done that. Bobega. And in with a real chance. And there it is. That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Chance to finish. In it goes. Such a complete performance. Four in front now. La ringraziamo per aver accettato di parlare ai nostri microfoni. Lasciamo andare il mister che ringraziamo.